Hello everyone guys, and this is a not a simple video uh, for my channel, Pedro with you of course, and here I want to show you how I make my edits, how to make an After Effects like edit in a CapCut. So you can make it in a um, mobile version of CapCut and a PC version of CapCut, because these two applications does not vary, they are the same. So as you know, uh, as you see here is an edit, actually, I'll just uh, make myself a little bit uh, smaller. And let's watch an uh, edit that you will be able to make uh, after you watch this video. So as you can see, there is a bunch of cool stuff in this edit. For example, some lightning effects, uh, text that uh, appears and bro broads out like this. Uh, yes, and uh, some drop right here. Uh, these slow down effect that uh, are mm, very popular in After Effects, but I figured out how to do it in a CapCut. Here is a little outro and yeah, so basically, as you know, my channel is based on uh, edits. I, I made so many edits, there are so many views, but these edits are much more simpler than this one. Uh, than this one. Sorry. Uh, than this one. So, uh, but I didn't upload this edit to my channel because, I don't know, for some, for some reason. Maybe I'll upload it later. So, first of all, the thing you need to know about making an edit, you need to come up with an idea, with a niche. So, in my case, this is Skibri Toilet Edits. This is a niche for my channel. Uh, the second thing you should know about is you need to know what song you will use. So, this song must be viral, it must be popular, or it must have a nice drop in the middle. So, as you can see, this song has drop right here. And that what it makes this song cool for edits because that is why we all watch edit. That is why they look cool. So when you come up with an audio, in my case it is wake up moon it is super ultra slow. Mm, you need to start downloading a footage that you want to crop. So in my case I already cropped the footage. Uh, I will not show how to crop a footage because in my in my opinion it is very simple. Everyone should know how to crop footage so uh, now i'll show you the first uh thing so in my in this tutorial i will show you how to make this text i'll show you how to make these uh lightning effects i'll show you how to make this slow down effect and i'll show you how to make this zoom in effect so and after you know all the things you I will be able to do this entire edit because it it just repeats all these steps. So first of all, text. So um, you need to know where the character is saying something. Uh, he's saying something like right here. So you need to go to the different project, create a new project in our case. And here we need to go to text, then basic and then default and start typing whatever he is saying. For example, uh, I'll just leave you a message here. Subscribe. Yeah, important message, by the way. So now you need to come up with the font, with the, with the size of the text, with the color, everything you want. You can edit it as you want. And then you can add some stroke, for example, white stroke here, or you can just make it white and the stroke is will be uh, red so something like this then you need to add an animation which broads out these text and you need to go to animations so yeah, it took me a while to find this effect but it called expand and it is in out section so for now on it expands too quickly and only in the end so we need to uh, increase duration by turning this slider to the left and now it just expands a little bit slower and from the beginning so now we need to export this thing um, to name it as we want something like that then we need to go back to our main project here it is 
and uh, basically now we need to get this image here so now as we moved uh, these uh, text to, to here it expands but it now have this black uh, background we need to get rid of the black black background we need to choose blend here in the basic blend and then expand then mode and then brighten or screen i'll choose brighten because it looks a little bit um, better so you need to expand it as you want and now you have this type of text for example this toilet says subscribe follow for all of you um so how to make this appearing effect uh, like this like this here i have so how to make it we need to uh, make a mask so we need to choose here a mask then choose horizontal and then make it 90 degrees so now we need to move it to the left and make a keyframe so this is the beginning and the finish one finish keyframe we need to also make the start keyframe and finish keyframe so start keyframe is on the left and finish keyframe is on the right so is on the right will be something like there uh, we need to move it to the right and make a keyframe so now it looks like this but you need want to make it a little bit faster for example, you need to make it faster or slower. This is uh, all on your mind. So, for example, here. So, you can make a little bit more feather. So, it will just um, uh, appear more like uh, slightly. Something like that. Um, that is basically, that is how you can make this appearing text. You can play with it as much as you want to make it look as good as here because it is much more like uh, like slower here so uh, now you know how to make this appearing text in the cap cut uh, that all, everybody makes in the after effects so next thing i'll show you uh, how to make these uh, glowing effects so uh, for these glowing effects we will need uh, adjustment so how to find adjustment uh, we need, just need to go here adjustment and then uh, drag this custom adjustment uh, to above our uh, fragment and increase it as long as we want so uh, you can now just copy the uh, options from here so i have temp 0 tin 0 saturation to 8 exposure 0 contrast 8 highlight 10 shadow 8 white 0 black 0 brilliant 0 sharpen 50 clarity 0 0 0 0 and vignette zero, also 0 so uh, when you just copy these uh, numbers you will have this slightly light effect so now what we are going to do next we need to uh, add edge glow and nostalgic light to our project we can find them in the effects right here so edge glow uh as i remember is in lens yeah here it is edge glow just simply drag it right there increase it now you see it glows a little bit and then nostalgic light i don't actually remember where it is but yeah here it is in the retro uh folder so you also need to expand this uh, and then here it is here is this effect you can also play with these effects as much as you want but i will leave it like that so yeah uh, now what you are going to do next uh, you know now how to make a text how to make a cool text how to make a uh, color effects some lightning effects the next thing i'll show you is how to make this slow down effect and this zoom in effect so uh, as you know I'll just add this uh, to here for a second. And as you know, you need to find a drop on your audio. It is right here. You need to, you can actually zoom in to look at this a little bit better. So uh, drums are here like do 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 do. Yeah, and these are the time where we are, where we want to zoom in our uh, 
our footage. So we need to expand this a little bit more. Two, 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 two. So now the first drum is here. So we need, we need to crop it here by clicking this button and then zoom in a little bit. Then find the second drum, something like there. Then crop it again and then scale it as well. So the next thing, so now you know how to make this zoom in effect. So you need to just expand it a little bit. So that is how it should look like. You need to just simply crop it and the uh, drops and then zoom in. So now I'll show you how to make these, um, this effect, the slow down effect. So uh, to do this effect, uh, we need actually to expand this one. So not expand this one, to copy this one. And then paste it here. And this will be uh, the time where we want to add the slowdown. So to make this slowdown effect, all we have to do now is to make um, make like a a footage that we want to slow down. Actually, I'll just copy it from my uh, previous project. So we need to go to speed, then curve, then none. And here we need to choose a custom and customize it like that. Like here I have, you, need to you, you can just copy this picture. So you, you need to drag these things. Uh, and then you need to toggle on smooth slow mo and then uh, optical flow. So the slow mo will look much, much better. I don't know if this option available on mobiles, but on the PC it is available. So as you can see, this is a slow down effect. It looks cool. So uh, you can just uh, use these templates, but I'll I always use these uh, custom effects. It looks really cool. And you just now need to copy these uh, slowdown to different footages as the beat drops. So here, as you see, beat drop, and you just copy it to make it look like this. Yeah. And that is basically everything you need to know how to make uh, After Effects like Edit and CapCut. It is very, very simple. And you don't need to watch some <laughs> complicated tutorials about After Effects. So this, pro this program is simpler than you think. It is uh, very user friendly and you can start making edits right, bef uh, right after you watch this video. So, um, I'm, I hope this video was helpful for you guys. And now you know how, how I make my edits because I saw so many comments how I make my edits. So I'll, I just made the video about this. So if you found this video useful, I hope you found it. Uh, you can subscribe to my channel and like this video and share it with your friends. I really appreciate it. So yeah, that's all I want to say. So bye bye guys. See you soon in the next videos.